sometimes in the business you will have a hot artist, someone who gets all the primo jobs, who is on the latest books, the, the big books, the top line. And you'll have people who are trying to copy that style, to emulate that style in an effort to get into the business. And sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes they're so obviously doing that because they want to know how uh, an artist makes a line, but sometimes not so much why. And what I would challenge those people to do is look at the influence of, influences of their own um, idols, the people that they're trying to copy. If it is something they learned in school, if it's someone that they idolized, that they copied, or they have learned from, maybe they were uh, assistants at some point. Maybe that's just part of uh, their process. But by going back to the greats, the people who have started, I've talked before about comic book veterans. We have so much to learn from those people. And not just artists, but writers as well. People who are editors. They have stories to tell about the people that they worked with. And sometimes the, create, the creators and the creations have been influences, influenced by so many factors that by learning history, the history of, of the business, of the projects, the characters, the creators, you learn more than you bargain for. So learn from the greats because some of them are still around and it's time to learn from them before it's too late.